And what's going on you bastards and welcome back to another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle video. So today we're taking on the Infinite Dragon Ball History event, one of the newest stages out here on Global. And uh, we are taking it on with uh, Universe 6 ourselves. So we're bringing, uh, obviously we have uh, Keflis as the lead, then we have, you know, Kaba to help her out. And then we have uh, Kale and Khalifa LR, then we have... Khalifa and Kale, and then we're bringing the OG Kefla. I'm not sure how it's gonna go bringing her because she she was never really like a very outstanding unit to me. Uh, but anyway, that's my opinion. But uh, we'll see if we could do this no item. I have a feeling we might run into some uh ohs in the beginning, and we might have to. But uh, Anyways, we'll see, and let's get into the event. Since I don't have Int Vados, I probably would have opted to bring her. But since I don't, I I won't, I guess. Okay, so we're going to offer take Kaba. We're going to get uh, uh, Tech, Khalifa, and Strength Kale on rotation. Then we're going to uh, have a, a Kaba and our friend who's at 79%. Uh, Kefla. And then we'll just, uh, throw mine to the wayside. <laughs> Pretty much. So, I, uh, I haven't made a- Ah, crap, it's on one time. Son of a bitch. I haven't made a, an actual video on these guys, uh, on their awakenings. But, uh, you know, I, I'll, I'll get to that eventually. Because the Kayla Khalifa, not the LR, but these singular units, the base form Kale and Khalifa, are pretty fantastic. Like, I don't know what what Dokkan's problem with uh, in making these units very good, but uh, they uh, they done did it. All right, and we got the LR popping off. Of course, and then we got Kaba here. You got a decent amount of orbs, nothing crazy. He's only at 55% too, so he's not, he's definitely not gonna be hitting the hardest. I just hope his uh, defense can hold up. All right, so we got the friend here. We got the OG Kefla. Uh, well, she changed a lot of orbs for us, so thank you, Kefla. And, uh, even when she, uh, especially when the OG Kefla's, uh, when that unit first came out, it didn't have the Awakening, right? Uh, you needed to get the physical type orbs to actually, uh, get, like, the uh, attack bonus. I don't know, I can't remember exactly if it, you got defense as well. But just having, like, the defensive or attack bonus only on physical orbs, it was, it was a little rough. Alright, so Kale shows up just having more defense and attack than Khalifa. Uh, they're both at 90% and opted more for additionals. And what, wait. I think this was before her awakening that it, I got her that. Okay, well, doesn't really matter. I'm not going to go into details, really, about what they both do since this video isn't really for them and which uh, hopefully we just wreck face here 1.37 from her pretty good and then she can uh additional a whole lot and possibly a third okay no it's Khalifa's turn Well, she didn't get an additional. I feel gypped. Oh well, ain't no, ain't no big deal. All right, well, we got the LR. Just so, a lot of this gameplay is going to be additional super attacks, cause. <laughs> The, the KL, the Khalifa, the KLA and Khalifa, but you know, possibly the Kefla. And 
A. Okay, so we got we got the rotation we need. Um, I would put. I want to see Kefla kind of right here. Yeah, I'll do it anyway. I'll give Kaba these. So if we do get super attacked, we can kind of defend against it. And then uh, I just want to do it with the two Keflas together. Which, although there's probably no attack links that we're missing between... You know, we we got Super Saiyan and Fierce Battle. Wait, no. Oh, yeah. Fierce Battle, I think. Yeah. This Kappa doesn't have yet Shattering the Limit. Okay. So, not too bad. 2.5. Pretty much only with Kappa is Super Saiyan and Fierce Battle active. Nice. Sue. Alright, so we got the other uh, Kefla to transform, but uh, again, it's going to be off-rotating. I thought about maybe dabbling going in back in the banner, but... Because I kind of low-key do want Android 13, but at the same time, I know once I get them, I'm just never going to use them, dude. Like, straight up. And I thought about using coins, but uh, not really the most uh, coin-worthy unit. That's going to do a little bit. Yeah. Oh. Wait, did we get guard? Oh, yeah. So, since we have a Khalifla on rotation, we get guard. Always. That's stupid. Like, it's it's kind of crazy that that's a thing. And I forget what uh, Khalifla gets with uh, a Kale. I, I guess we could take a look at it real quick. So, the first time I did this event, uh, I didn't do it. Spoiler alert, I already beat this. I didn't do it with uh, this Kale and Khalifa. Oh, we got a triple. I did it with the uh, World Tournament reward ones, and they work fantastic as well, dude. They're, they're pretty much the same units. Like, it's pretty silly. Yeah, 1.38, dude. That's like no links. No attack links active. Wait, no. Shouldn't this... Shouldn't that Kale and Khalifa have... Shouldn't they have Fierce Battle since they awaken for some weird reason for, um, uh... The Kefla event. Let me see. Hey, yep, they do have fierce battle, and uh, Khalifa gets. Oh yeah, medium chance of uh, additional attack, medium chance of becoming super attack. Which I feel like uh, Kale gets the uh, better end of the stick there, because always having guard. That's really good. Alright, so we're not getting enough orbs for Kefla. We're not getting the six orbs to be uh, super effective. I mean, no, sorry. To additional super. But it's all good. The first team I did this with was, uh, it was kind of troll. It was Universal Survival Saga with uh, two of the uh, Spirit Bomb uh, uh, Blue Kaioken Gokus. LRUI Goku. Kaba and Kefla, you know, strength Kefla, and then I had the LR uh, Kale and Khalifa, and then the Evolution Vegeta. So I had essentially five strength units and two AGL units. I was like, this is pretty troll, but it wasn't too bad, you know. Of course, AGL uh, or AGL uh, Blue Kaioken Goku just got clapped at some points. So, all right, so. We're just gonna keep Kefla there, cause right, she keeps her dodging. Well, we don't know how much her dodge is, but hey, whatever. Ah, crap. This is a lot of orbs. I kind of want to keep large clusters of orbs for uh, Kefla. Yeah, that might work out. That might work out. 1.59 from this lady. Pretty good. And then she just keeps, she keeps going. And she just keeps going. It's pretty nutty. Well, oh, okay, that's the fight. That was the hidden potential one. Not from like, her passes. Wow, so four supers right there. That's why I also did some crit in her, right? Because, uh... If you got, imagine getting the four super attacks, possibly three, right? Because if I went more crit, I might not have gotten that last additional super right there. Hey, the dodge. Hey, the dodge. 
A the dud? Units are stupid. But, uh... Yeah, imagine the three super attacks critting as well. Yeah, well, then we've got physical Kefla trying to, uh... Trying to do her thing. I was excited for when this unit first came out, but then you're just like, eh. Oh, That was a little bit of, uh, damage we took right there. Alright, now, uh, my Kefla finally reached Super Chain 2. Not gonna use any of the actives for a while. Ooh, that's a chonky amount of orbs. Let's go. Alright, let's look at Kefla's stats. 1.43, of course, with the 50% and 1.21 on the other one. Or, er, 121, sorry. Getting a little, little ahead of myself there. Thinking they're defensive stacking units. We always gotta... We're coming along for a Doken attack here. 2.89. So, Kefla's numbers definitely jump around a little bit. Oof. And that was a super effective, and we're critting. Not super effective. I keep saying that, dude. It's the additional super. It, her active makes her super effective. I don't know why that keeps messing with me. Like, I almost... I, I think I, I'm kind of getting her confused with the way, like, Majin Vegeta and the uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku, the, you know, transforming units, how they work. All right, so, I mean, we good here, but damn, boy. it's a lot of defense. Let's do that. I'll try to avoid, like, wait, no. Mm, I'll try to set up for a Doken attack next turn with Kefla. Because we're going to have, well, we're going to have, let's see, Kefla, Kaba. Ooh, dang. That did nothing. And... Is it physical Kefla? Yeah. I think it might be physical Kefla. Alright, so what they need to do, honestly, is make a better version of the Super Saiyan 2 kill. Because her free-to-play support type one... I don't know, man. It's good in places, but like... Think of how like strong she was in the in the show. Yeah, like she was she was pretty she was pretty strong given the circumstances. So like make it make a card to reflect that. Next thing you know, they'll have like a transforming uh, like base form. It would be bad, right? They shouldn't do that. Actually, it'd be like a Super Saiyan or. A new Berserk Kale that maybe goes this, like, uh, Super Saiyan 2, like, controlled Kale. Because if they do a base form, dude, there, there's two other great Kales that you're just, uh... That you'd potentially be replacing. Maybe not, because they're just too good maybe not to replace. Okay, so, I feel really bad here. So, we... Ah, oh, man. I kind of want to avoid the Doken attack now, but for shits and giggles... Uh, looks like we're gonna get... Oh, shit. Because ideally, I want to have... Wait. Oh, she's only getting 6k more in the middle there. Being linked up. Okay, never mind. It doesn't matter. Let's say I feel kind of... Kind of bad. We, we could uh, see her get really cracked out, but... Uh, I mean, with only that much damage difference, it doesn't really matter. So she might hit pretty darn hard here. She's at a 3.16 mil attack stat. And she would be doing another one. Gonna go all out. Gonna go all out. Alright. See how much damage this is gonna do. Is this gonna one shot her? I think it'll one shot her if it crits. Or not. Okay, what do I know? Never mind. Don't mind me. Yeah, yeah. I kind of overestimated how uh, Kale would do there. The uh, the enemy Kale. So, eh, it's all good. Ooh. 
Yeah, this time at the end is going to be a little skewered. Hey, we'll give mine some love right there. We'll get, we'll get her some orbs that she needs. Hopefully she doesn't get super, though. That'd be really unfortunate. Time's going to be a little skewered. Because, oh, I forgot she dodges. Here, here's another one, boy. Thought you get away. Uh, because I just feel like the audio is a little off, but I keep checking in. And it's fine. I don't know. I feel like I have the sound effects maybe too high or the music. That's why I kind of just, like, mute the whole, uh, Dokkan as a whole. But every so often, I, I like to throw in the in-game music and sounds, you know. Less editing you had to do. You know, adding the music. Alright, we literally took nothing. So I guess in exchange for this, uh, Khalifa getting a, a shit ton of dodge and whatnot, they made her not as hard of, of a hitter as Kale. Because she's definitely a slack in the, or a defensive stacker, really. But, I mean, do you really need defense if you dodge, though? You can have zero defense as long as you, if you like, always dodge. It doesn't even matter. Alright, so there's my, uh, Kefla. Just, you know, doing her best. Off rotation, 55%. You know, my name's not, you know, Shelby, and I can't pull, uh, two of these guys on the, uh, 30... What, the 35 stone multi or whatever the hell it was? The second multi in, the seven unit one. Lady pulled two of them. What? Disgusting. Oh, God. Oh, I don't know if we could give Kaba a whole lot of ore. Eh, that's good enough. That's that's definitely good enough. We're at full HP, too. Even if Kaba gets tagged, <clears throat> it's not the end of the world. 3.35. Let's go. See, hits the last person. Do we fight a Keflin here? I forgot. 3.46. I forgot. I forgot how this fight went, actually. 3.0. Oh, a triple. Yeah, pretty much with these events, I, I don't really look at the information. I think I looked at the youth one as soon as I did it, but, uh... <clears throat> I, I typically don't. I like to be a little bit surprised. Ah, crap. <clears throat> Alright, that might do a little bit. That was a lot of bit. It's alright. Uh, we do have a team that can heal up pretty nicely. Like, if the LR gets some orbs, if uh, Kaba gets a little bit of orbs, or Kefla, too-ish. Or if we get the, the other Kale and Khalifla. The singular units. Oh god, if this physical one though gets tagged. God, there's two attacks in the back. Hopefully she dodges. Well, I'm gonna do these to get these orbs. It's gonna be, yeah, this is definitely. Oh my god. I didn't realize her defense was gonna be that high. And then Khalifa's half, which is still. You know, kind of fantastic. I'm gonna get... I, I think I'm gonna get all of those, right? Because if we get tagged with a super attack in the back, we're dead. We're, like, straight up dead. And I don't know what her defense is gonna be now. Please super me. Su super Khalifa. 2.19. Oh, my God. 2.24. <clears throat> Please super me. Super, Super Khalifa. Please, it'll hit, I promise. Hey, that's the hidden potential. I think? Yeah. Pretty sure. Super! Ah, oh, fuck. No! Oh, oh god. Kefla, you better... You better dodge your ass off, please. Oh, I thought that was—I thought that was the super tech on. I'm just like, oh god, we're dead. Cause she will not tank any of this well. No, dodge. Whoa! No, no. Well. Get back to it. 
Alright, so I'm gonna say it. Physical Kef was hot trash. I'm gonna say it. Because I went back through this to do it again, and the same exact scenario happened where she just got... She just got clapped. And I was like, oh no, please. So instead I brought the AGL Khalifla, which is uh, also another big risk. Because there's not... there's Since I don't have Int Vados, there's not a real solid other Universe 6 unit to make. Or to take, sorry. And I was thinking about it, dude. As good as Kefla is, dude, this Kale kind of dookies on her. Because if you get three additional, or three super attacks, you know, that's a six mil attack stat. You don't take any damage at all. You know, it's, it's just kind of silly. And, you know, she's just, like, essentially better. This Khalifa, with their hunt, like, with their OP amounts of dodging. And, well, her damage isn't that great. Right there, nah, she, maybe not her, but the strength Kale is, like, Dare I say almost better than Kefla. Granted, she needs a very she needs a long time to get going, but hey. Maybe longer events, I'll say that. And then, you know, I got her to super attack four times. A couple times. And then it's just it's it's over an eight mil attack stat. That's nutty. What can you do against Oh crap, he's gonna lock. Oh no. Okay, so if it looks like it here. I'm just gonna use items, dude. I'm tired of doing this over and over again. Real talk. Crap, and he locked. He locked my Kefla that's been off rotation this whole time. I don't know how much damage he's gonna do to. Shit. To an, uh. A type advantage unit. I'm sure it's gonna be Oodles. But we'll see. We'll see here how much. The normals will... Okay, so... Alright, we might take 200k here. Not even close. Alright, never mind, sorry. Not even... Well, okay. I... Look, listen. This event's got me... Low expectations on units. Like, Kefla and Kaba are pretty much the only units that I had to worry about. Well, now the AGL uh, Khalifla. Oh, because he disables dodging too. Oh, shit. That's why, right? Because I put orbs in her. Okay, that's good. I put orbs in her. Uh, In this AGL Khalifla. So she gets, like, a lot of additional. So she can raise her defense. But, uh, and I gave her, like, six dodge as well. But we'll see, we'll see. I'm a little, I'm a little shooketh. What's her defense at? <laughs> oh, speaking of, oh god, their defense. Let me get that one orb right there. Heal up a little bit, and god, dude. She had, oh no, I should have used an item. Oh no, I'm trolling. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no. I should have, I should have just used an item. Wait, no, super attack, super attack, super attack, uh, Kale, please. Please. Please hit, I beg you. Super attack kill. You gonna let her get away with this? Super attack her. And his dodgings are kinda annoying too. The, his locking is more annoying, but his dodging too. Please. Oh wait, no. What if Kale gets two more su- Ah, oh, shit. I was gonna say, two more supers that are crit- No. Please don't. Please. Please don't hurt me. Sir. Another super attack, please. Oh god. Oh my god. 95k. Real talk though? I could be a little spicy. Right, l hear me out. Kalen Khalifa won't take anything. I give Kefla these. And then I get Kaba. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna risk this because we're gonna we're gonna risk it for the no item. And if I die here, I am not playing this again. Because we're gonna have like three minimums like super attacks or some shit like that here. He can't dodge them all. Impossible. 
And he takes a lot of damage. Okay, so. No item run on uh, Universe 6 versus Universe 6. This has not been as much fun as I would like. Because going through this again, I just watched some like Guresh videos while I was redoing it. But anyway, you bastards, that's going to do it for the event. Oh, okay, so I'll show the end screen to prove that I didn't use any items. And how long this kind of took. Was it over 30 minutes? 24. Oh, okay. Wait, really? So the last time I fought Hit, it was I didn't get a good estimate of how strong he was or whatever. Because I used Blue Kaioken Goku's Spirit Bomb on him. And all, literally, he had less than a bar of HP left. I'm just like, oh, okay, easy to easy. Anyway, you bastards, thanks for coming by. I'll see you in the next one. Take care.